of Bishop Fian, lane seven, Matt Brown of Swampscott, lane eight, Anthony Zhu of Wayland, and lane nine, Nicholas Wang of Sharon. And then in the middle lane, lane five, Noah Labick comes in with a seat time of 151.92, which is under the meet record time, and it's also under the All-American consideration time as well. So keep an eye on him, and he's already out in front of the rest of the field. His seat time almost seven seconds faster than the next fastest qualifying time. Yeah, 24.03, and I'm guessing that he might have swum the backstroke leg of the Amherst Pella medley relay. So he's got a great front half of this, this event. Slightly long glide into the wall off the fly leg. Hopefully that won't make a difference in this swim. But he is way out in front of the rest of the pool right now. 51.33 as compared to a 54, which is our prior fastest split. That was a 27.3 backstroke leg from Labick. And he's got a good-looking breaststroke here as well. I wouldn't be surprised if he posts the fastest split for this leg. And the lead just continues to grow. It's now about half a pool length lead. It's a very tight rate race for second. But Labeck right now, we're keeping an eye on him as there is a meet record potentially in his sights. Yeah, so he's got to be back in just 28 flat. And uh, he's going to be he's going to be well under this meet record. Question is, is can he lock up that All American automatic? That's a 149.57. And Labeck will come in with a 156.9, which is just off the pace of that automatic All American time. In second is Shu of Whalen with a 159-16, followed up.